Over the time in the near future, the waters around St. Mary's, Georgia, Kings Bay Submarine Naval Base, could change a lot. It's home to the largest covered dry dock for submarines in all of the North American area. So the docks are used to work on the maintenance of submarines for months at a time. But as Nick Perot explains tonight, the docks themselves, they're in need of repair. We're standing outside the gate right now for security reasons next to this submarine command exhibit. And we can tell you, according to the Navy, that maintenance is needed. That's because the stock is in use nearly 90% of the time working on submarines, leaving very little time for work on the dock itself. The first sentence for the purpose of a 225 page report is clear. Major repairs are needed for what's known as the dry dock at Kings Bay Submarine Naval Base. In this video posted by the Navy, you can see the bay is in use as the USS Georgia undocks after extended maintenance in March. Facility and safety conditions, though, have significantly degraded since construction in 1990, according to the report. If the dock itself is not repaired, submarine maintenance could stop altogether, as it would be a safety concern. So why does all this matter to you at home? Well, the moves can also reduce the amount of available housing nearby as up to 500 workers could come to this area to complete the job. This could, of course, affect traffic along St. Mary's and Kings Bay Road. The report, though, also points to the idea the area could see an increase in business at area restaurants and shops as a result. And we can tell you that work is expected to take place over a three year period with work beginning after March of next year. In St. Mary's, Georgia tonight, Nick Perot, First Coast News on your side.